hi in this video we will create a list and this list will be composed of multiple integer numbers and these integer numbers will be generated by using some random technique so we can use some random method to generate that thing so uh, by right by using this program basically we can generate random numbers within a given range and store it in a list okay so this whenever this program will run it will ask user how many numbers he or she wants to generate and then after that this program will ask what will be the starting point and what will be the ending point that means the range it will ask the user uh, to provide the range and based on that it will create uh, random numbers and put that in a list so let's get started in this tutorial i am going to use uh, visual studio code and i am using python programming language altogether okay so at first we have to ask user uh, how many numbers he or she wants to generate so we can capture this information by using some input mechanism in python we can use input and then in this method we can put a meaningful message like how many numbers how many numbers do you wish to generate right in the list okay so how many numbers do you wish to generate in the list the user will give some input right and let's uh, convert this thing in a integer okay so we'll, we are going to convert the user input uh, to an integer number okay so this is a data type and later we are assigning this thing into a variable suppose the variable name is uh, number uh, no for example number okay so total number of like this thing so here user will put like five number or six number it will uh, put and then after that it is converting to integer number and finally we are uh, con uh, actually storing this information inside a variable it's called number okay and then it will ask user how many what is uh, not how many basically what is the range from which range the user is interested to generate the number okay so what we can do we can actually copy this thing and then we can paste two times okay so i'm showing you how i did this thing so there will be a start range right start start range and there will be one end range okay so i i type two variable one is start and there is end and here it will ask what is the starting range okay so here we can actually modify the message what is the starting range okay so it will ask the user what is the starting range and also it will ask uh, what is the ending range okay so it will ask user this three information and based on that it will generate numbers and it will create on dynamic list okay so now to do this thing we can actually create one function right so the function name we can use like def that means definition and then we can create the function name so any function name is fine but i'm going to write a function name which is meaningful right uh, random number list for example this is uh, my function name and for the beginning let's put pass okay so that there will be no error okay and in this method we have to implement uh, the logic which can generate the list okay so here we should uh, put three uh, parameter right because we need to pass these three pass these three information like uh, total number then start and end right so we can put it like total number and then start and then end okay so these three param uh, parameter or argument we can pass from the main program and here now we have to implement so i'm going to delete this thing okay and then what we have to do at first we need to define on uh, like empty variable which can be a list right so uh, for example uh, our targeted result is like a re result equal to empty list so based on this number like total number it will generate the numbers okay if it is five it will generate five numbers and it will put inside this uh, empty list okay so we definitely need on for loop so i'm going to type this for and then we are using uh, this code snippet so that it will finish uh, some part okay so 
here just uh, type on variable name suppose uh, i okay in an expression so here it will go till uh, this part right the end okay so we can use a range range so here range will be total number right total no n o number okay so it will start from i to this this number okay and here what we have to do we have to uh, tell that generate the number okay so here we can use this thing random but before using this random we need to import one package so i'm going to import one package it is called import random so now uh, if we uh, we can actually use the method from that random package okay so what i am doing random dot that rank integer there is a method it is called rank integer so it will generate random integer okay i'm uh, selecting that and then here we have to type the range so here is start and end so we can type start and comma end but here uh, in random number gen, gen, uh, when you use this random integer at the time we have to remember that if the user wants to generate a number in between 0 to 9 the last range should be 10 always plus 1 okay so if the user tries to generate like a number between 0 to 5 so the range should be 0 to 6 here because it will end 1 before okay so here n we have to type n plus 1 okay so then it will be in this range and finally what we have to do we have to add this value uh, to this like this result set right so here we can and uh, define on temporary variable like temp so this is the random number okay and then after that what you have to do we have to add this thing to this result set okay so we are going to uh, use result result dot then append okay because we need to add and what we have to append we have to append this temp okay so we are going to append this number and finally uh, once uh, this result set is completed then what we can do we can return, return the result set so we can type return then this result okay so that's all the function is complete okay so what we did we created a function where uh, we actually has we initialize on empty result set and then after that uh, it is actually calculating the thing uh, like this is uh, the thing uh, based on the range user is choosing from here and then it is appending all the uh, results to this range uh, result sets okay so now uh, let's run it okay so before running actually uh, we also need to do one more thing we have to call this method otherwise uh, this program will uh, not uh, actually generate the random numbers so to call this method actually what we have to do we have to call this method by this method name random number list okay and then we have to pass uh, these three information like number then start then end okay so that's all and then finally what we have to do we have to print uh, this list okay so uh, we can uh, print uh, by using print method okay and then we can print this thing so it will print the list because the output is a result and here we can also uh, put some string so that it will be meaningful uh, generated generated uh, number list number list okay and then we can uh, put on argument like zero and then uh, dot format you can use format method uh, to format this thing okay and that's all basically uh, everything is completed so here we are seeing on error basically so we have to put another parenthesis so then uh, the error will be gone okay now uh, our program is almost done so we just need to run it so we can run it by right click and then choose run python file in terminal okay and then it is asking how many numbers do you wish to generate in the list suppose we want to generate like uh, seven item uh, seven elements right so what we have to do we have to type here seven so i'm typing seven and then it is asking what is the starting range suppose our starting range is 100 okay then i'm pressing enter and then it is asking what is the ending range suppose we want to generate a number in between 100 to 200 so here we have to type 
200 okay so uh, now press enter and it will show you the generated number okay so we generated seven number seven items one two three four five six seven and all the numbers are in between 100 and 200 right so all numbers are in between this thing so let's uh, try one more time whether uh, to check basically whether this program is working or not so i'm going to delete it and run it right click and then i'm choosing run python file in terminal okay so here is asking um, how many numbers do you wish to generate in the list so suppose in this time i want to generate like uh, 20 items for example okay then press enter and what is the starting range suppose the starting range is like uh, 5 okay and what is the ending range suppose the ending range is 100 okay then press it uh, press enter and then you will see uh, it is generating all the numbers in between uh, 5 and 100 right see here all the numbers are in between that and there are total 20 numbers so if you uh, like add one two three in this way you will find 20 different numbers are there and this is a list array list or list okay so that's all guys in this way you can easily create a program uh, which can generate random numbers within a given range and a store in a list so that's all guys hopefully by watching this video you are able to generate random numbers within a given range and a store in a list and if this video is helpful for you uh, please consider subscribing to our channel thank you for watching the video